Chapter 50 Prepare for a rainy day you are listening at NovelFull.audio. The colonial circle is divided into ten districts, and the country where Long Fei is located, Mijiaangwa, belongs to the sixth district. Both the first district and the eighth district have a unified country ruling a colonial area. The ruling country of the first district is called the Garth Empire, and the ruling country of the eighth district is called the Wanluo Federation. These two countries can be regarded as the two most powerful countries in the colonial circle. When the Garth Empire unified the first district, it has been in power for nearly 20 years. With 20 years of full development and no foreign wars, the economy of the Garth Empire has reached a peak, and the population growth has also reached a peak. The Garth Empire's efforts to develop the economy are mainly for all preparations for foreign wars. The wars cost money, resources, and manpower. The Garth Empire is already ready and ready to move. It depends on which country in the two colonial areas will ignite the powder keg of the Garth Empire to attack the second district next to it or the tenth district. Although the Wanluo federal state in the 8th district implements a SODOT called democratic system and talks about human rights, freedom, and equality, in fact, it often does some shameless things that steal chickens and dogs. Secretly send some national spies to sneak into the target country, then get in touch with the local opponents, allocate funds to support the opponents, and then use the media to spread rumors to discredit the target country in an attempt to subvert the regime of the target country. Those who want to be righted up and controlled as a puppet state. What the Wanluo Federation has done is often joked among many discerning people that it is on the same side as the cowboy Li Jianguo in the Earth Circle, and they are simply twin brothers. The cowboy Li Jian country in the Earth Circle is just a joking name given to this country by many people. The real name is the United States of America. These two countries also have the same system. They both talk about democracy, freedom, and equality of human rights every day. In fact, as long as it is for their own interests, these talking things can be thrown aside. Wars in many countries have shadows of these two countries, and countries where wars have occurred will see arms sales from these two countries. If there is civil strife in a subversive country, the arms dealers behind them will happily open champagne to celebrate, because a large amount of endless arms benefits will enter their pockets. These two countries are not unscrupulous to engage other countries, they also have to look at the target, like the Garth Empire or the other two big countries in the Earth Circle, the Han Xia Empire and the Russian Soviet Republic, are the targets they dare not provoke. Looking at the news of the past few days, Long Fei deduced that there may be wars in many countries. In this war, there are also shadows of these two countries. The war may be presented in the form of agents. It is estimated that many countries that launched wars have secret funding from these two countries. Moreover, Long Fei also deduced that there might be a war in the 6th district of the colonial area in the next few months. Long Fei twisted his neck a few times and said. Looks like I have to get ready as soon as possible, maybe the outbreak of war will also be the benefit of us arms dealers, next, I have to study the things brought back from the Jupiter spacecraft. In the next few days, Long Fei was studying the unknown metals and unknown liquids of the Jupiter spacecraft. Several meteorites around the mother base are transformed into manufacturing factories, ecological environment factories or military bases, etc. The strike dagger MS happened to manufacture one today, and President Sakiki asked Commander.in. Chiefly jumping to ask for a MS driver for testing. The MS driver arranged by Li Jiaming was not an ace, but a MS driver with mediocre driving skills. This MS driver with mediocre driving skills, after testing the strike dagger, gave an evaluation that driving is much easier than Jim MS, I am afraid that it is for a child to drive, as long as a few days of training can be enough driving the assault dagger MS. President Sake Chi was a little surprised after reading the report and evaluation, but she thought that the driver might be fooling her, so she decided to test driving the strike dagger MS by herself. President Sake Chi himself doesn't know how to drive a mobile phone, so he asked the test driver to teach her how to drive a mobile phone. After a few hours of teaching, 
President Sakiki has slightly mastered the basic operation of driving a mobile phone. President Saki personally drives the Strike Dagger MS. After several hours of testing, President Sakiki couldn't believe that even she, an ordinary person who didn't know how to drive a mobile phone a few hours ago, could drive a Strike Dagger mobile phone. President Saki finally believed that the Assault Dagger MS is a very easy to operate MS. Team leader Shi Tingfen, who was in charge of writing the MS operating system, was an old classmate of hers back then, and now is her boss, Long Fei. She couldn't believe that a single person had already designed the Strike Dagger MS, and even designed and written an easy dot to dot operate OS. However, Shi Tingfen didn't have nothing to do according to the OS written by the boss, and the details of the OS can continue to be simple. Shi Tingfen asked President Sakiki to give her a few more days to improve the OS to be simpler and easier to control. President Saki agreed to her request. A few days later, Shi Tingfen really improved the OS to be easier. After being tested and verified, it is evaluated, which means that smart children will be able to get started soon. President Sakiki immediately asked her public relations team to publicize the Strike Dagger MS. Then four days later, Thunder Gundam was officially manufactured and put into testing. The next day, the Reaper Gundam was officially completed and put into testing, and the test driver was still the same person. After the two Gundams of Reaper Thunder have been tested with each other, each has its own advantages. As for which of the two is more suitable for use on the battlefield, it must be verified in actual combat. The three Gundams of Aegis, Storm, and Heavy Gunner are also being manufactured, and the Gemini brothers are also on the schedule. As soon as the first three are completed, the pair of brothers will start to be manufactured, including their equipment. Long Fei has been researching unknown metals and unknown liquids during this time, and has made some progress. Among the unknown metals, there is a kind of platinum metal ore, which can be used as a substitute for the materials required for the solar furnace. Long Fei named this platinum metal or haojin. Long Fei, who had been shelving the plan to manufacture and test the solar furnace, had already produced a solar furnace for testing. Start the solar furnace test. The solar furnace started to operate, and the particles emitted during the operation were the same as in the original work, all of which were cyan particles. In the original book, when the cyan particles reach a certain density, they will harm the human body. When the cyan particles emitted by the solar furnace manufactured by Haojin reach the same density as in the original book, they are actually harmless to the human body. Renewable energy is 10% better than in the original book. Moreover, in the original book, the cyan particles will affect the functions of radar and communication equipment, etc., the solar furnace manufactured by Long Fei, in addition to having the above capabilities, can also be regulated so that radar and communication equipment will not be affected. Trans AM system launched. The solar furnace in the 3. Red state has improved a lot of performance as in the original work, and it is 5% better than the original work. This made Long Fei very satisfied. The fly in the ointment that made Long Fei feel is that there are not many Haoji mines. After settlement, about 10 solar furnaces can be produced. This is only the solar furnace used by Gundam. It is supplied by the Gundam solar furnace, and if all the Gundams are dispatched, the power supply time of the Tommies will be limited, then, there is one solar furnace for the battleship, and six solar furnaces for the Gundam. If it is to manufacture a pseudo-solar furnace, more can be manufactured, at least 50 or more can be manufactured, and the proportion of Hauji manufacturing required becomes less, and other materials can be used instead. But Long Fei didn't want to do this. The pseudo-solar furnace can't compare with the real solar furnace. If you want to make the 00 Gundam series Gundam, the most ideal is to use the real solar furnace to make it. If you use the pseudo-solar furnace, the effect will be great. Discount, and the red particles are harmful to people. There is a very strange thing about Haoji metal. To make a solar furnace, Long Fei performs simulation calculations. 
No matter how it is adjusted and improved, the red particles emitted are still harmful to the human body, so Long Fei decided that it is better to make a real solar furnace. Long Fei decided to build a Zero Gundam first to test the solar furnace and actual combat. Whether there will be a war in the next few months, no one knows. Everything we do is to plan ahead. Long Fei thought to himself. Chapter 51 Exhibition You are listening at NovelFull.audio I can't believe it, the boss actually developed something called a solar furnace. One solar furnace can supply the electricity needed by the base. The scary thing is that the solar furnace doesn't need any fuel or materials to supply, and it can generate energy by itself. It's just like the legendary perpetual motion machine. Several staff members in the base were talking while working. These days the base is testing the performance of the solar furnace, and the people in the whole base can't believe that a solar furnace for MS can actually supply the entire base with electricity. They were shocked by the solar furnace developed by their boss, Long Fei. This technology is enough to subvert the energy technology of the Earth Circle and the Colony Circle. If this technology is brought out, the boss will earn endless benefits. But they also knew that it was impossible for the boss, Long Fei, to disclose this technology. Because if the boss really comes up with this technology, it will touch the interests of all big families and big bosses of interest groups. At that time, the bosses will either force the boss to share the technology, or assassinate the boss, and then rob the boss of the technology. Hey, I heard that the test of the solar furnace has been completed, and our base has returned to the original energy supply. No way, why did the boss decide to stop the test and continue to use the solar furnace to supply electricity? No way, the boss is planning to use these solar furnaces on the newly designed Gundam. Shi Tingfen passed behind the employees at this moment, and she could hear everything these employees said clearly. It has been a while since I came here to work, and I often hear colleagues praise Long Fei as a god-like existence. At first, she thought it was just an employee flattering the boss. Later, she discovered that the MS, battleships, and individual weapons in the base, including the manufacturing machines in the factory, and the fully automated system, were all designed and manufactured by Long Fei alone. Only then did she understand why her colleagues all worshipped Long Fei and treated him like a god. She had been an old classmate for three years, she never thought that Long Fei would be so powerful, compared with him, those scientists and academicians in his country were nothing but idiots. The solar furnace that was recently produced, even if the Han Xia Empire gathered all the scientists in the country together, it might not be able to produce a solar furnace. Solar furnace, this is a black technology that subverts the world. Shi Tingfen saw Long Fei sitting on a box drinking coffee. Boss, take a coffee break. Long Fei watched Shi Tingfen sit next to him, nodded and said, Take a little rest, I want to relax myself. Shi Tingfen looked at the Grim Reaper, Strike and Dual Gundam being repaired by the front staff. These super mobile phones called Gundams are also mobile phones developed by the old classmate next to me. Boss, what are your plans next? Have you ever thought about returning to your hometown in the near future? The next plan is to continue to study, and I have no plans to return to my hometown in the near future. After finishing speaking, Long Fei took a sip of coffee and asked Shi Tingfen, Are you still used to working here? Well, I'm used to it, and I've already told my family that I've found a job, so they don't have to worry about it, and I'll tell my family not to tell Luo Tianyu that I went to the universe. It seems that you are here, working very cleanly, and you can work with peace of mind. Shi Tingfen shrugged and said, Actually, I'm an ambitious woman. I don't want to rely on men. I just want to rely on my own strength to prove myself. Facts have proved that you really have the ability. You can improve the details of the OS I wrote to make it more perfect. Shi Tingfen rolled her eyes directly, and said. Come on, compared with you, I am a piece of rubbish. I can't write the OS you wrote. I'm afraid it will be placed in our country. Those who have won several software engineering degrees doctor, 
I can't write your OS either. This is an OS written by you alone. I just help you deal with some details. And to put it bluntly, even if you don't deal with and improve some details, it won't affect Chang at all. The OS used to attack the short sword. Everyone has strengths and weaknesses. In these fields, I can be proud to say to those scientists that you are rubbish, but I have things that I am not good at, such as cooking and music. These are not things I can do. What I can do, I'm a music fanatic. You're right, everyone has their own areas of expertise. After Long Fei drank the last sip of coffee, he stood up and said. Okay, I have to go to work, don't be lazy. How dare, I don't dare to be deducted from my salary by your big boss. Shi Tingfen also stood up, ready to return to her post. Long Fei went to his exclusive laboratory for research. There are still many unknown metals and unknown liquids waiting for Long Fei to study. On the other side, Jenny Arms Manufacturing Company participated in an arms exhibition. Many companies participated and took out their mobile phones, fighter planes, individual weapons, tanks, etc. as exhibits. The relevant departments of Jenny Arms Manufacturing Company have sent people to pay attention and received information that this company has recently developed a new type of mobile phone. The country that Jim MS first purchased was the country of Mikaang. Mijiaangua once had a military conflict with a country, and there were small scale conflicts between the two countries. Mika Angua sent Jim MS, 40 Jim MS shot down 32 enemy fighters and 46 MS and MS motherships, two frigates and a destroyer. Only six of the Jim MS were shot down, and 14 suffered varying degrees of damage. This result shocked the countries of the 6th district of the colony. After investigation, it was found that it came from a Tiani Arms Manufacturing Company within the self-supporting range of Mijiaangua, and this company has set up branches in several countries in the 6th colonial region. L.RG the local country also purchased a large number of GM mobile phones. After verification by the local mobile phone pilots, the GM mobile phone not only has an advantage against other mobile phones, but also has a considerable advantage against fighter jets. However, although the countries involved in the purchase of Jim MS are satisfied with the performance and combat efficiency of Jim, they are somewhat dissatisfied with the price. The price of a Jim MS reached 50 million. The defense budget of the country involved in the procurement is not sufficient, so it cannot only purchase GM MS, so the country involved in the purchase of 100 GM MS, 25 units per year, and 100 units will be delivered in four years. Deliver batch dot by dot batch money. Of course, in addition to some countries that will purchase Jim MS, there are also some rich people who will also purchase Jim MS as their personal bodyguards to drive MS. In addition to displaying the special GM MS, Jenny Arms Manufacturing Company also displayed the Assault Dagger MS. These two MSs displayed today are the MS they want to sell. The custom-built GM MS has shown superb performance, and many countries want to purchase it. However, the price quoted by the custom-built GM MS is 80 million, and many countries that want to buy it can only retreat because of their cash dot strapped. Instead, it was another MS called Strike Dagger, and the price was only 30 million. Many people think that the price of MS called Strike Dagger is much cheaper than that of Jim MS, and the performance must be inferior to that of Jim. Moreover, some military magazines have introduced Assault Dagger MS, like a MS equipped with ordinary soldiers who can only use rifles. Chapter 52 Snap Up You Are Listening at Novel Full. Audio Many people watched the introduction of Assault Dagger MS. In addition to the 60mm Vulcan cannon and beam saber on the head, the equipped weapons are only a shield, a beam gun and a 120mm live ammunition rifle, President Saki made an additional design as a complete set for the sale of the Assault Dagger MS one of the weapons. These weapons are cheap because of the cheap price, and the armor used next is a relatively lightweight composite armor, resulting in a defense that is not as good as that of the Jim MS. The last is to use the battery to start. 
Seeing the introduction of such mobile phones, for some big countries, the weapons equipped with such mobile phones are slightly insufficient. If they are purchased, they will only be allocated to the border guards in charge of border defense, or equipped for the guards of the Space Patrol Agency. For those small or poor countries, the Assault Dagger MS is enough to be used as a national defense force. The Strike Dagger MS quoted a price of 30 million, which was a fair price no matter for a big country or a small country. Then, the Strike Dagger MS conducted a round of test demonstrations. What happened next took many people by surprise. The tester for the Strike Dagger MS was not actually a MS driver, but they randomly selected an ordinary person who participated in the exhibition. The ordinary people who were pointed out did not have any experience in driving mobile phones, and they were just military geeks who liked the military to participate in the exhibition. At the beginning, the military nerd who was invited to test the Strike Dagger MS was very shy and waved his hands quickly. He had never driven a MS before and dared not drive the Strike Dagger MS. After a round of explanations and pointers by the staff of Tiani Arms Manufacturing Company, the military otaku put on his driving suit. At the beginning of the operation, the otaku was very nervous, and after the guidance of the staff in front of the screen, the otaku slowly began to try to operate the assault dagger MS. From walking to running, the otaku gradually became more comfortable with the operation, and then to flying and jumping, the otaku gradually became more comfortable with the operation. Then when it comes to dodging and shooting these items, at the beginning, the otaku operation could not respond to the inaccurate dodging and shooting in a timely manner. But after more than 10 minutes, the otaku's operation began to become proficient, and soon in the dodging event, he was able to dodge perfectly in many places, and many shots hit the red dot. After this round of operations, many spectators were surprised. Could it be that the military otaku randomly pulled out by the Tiani Arms Manufacturing Company was a fake MS driver? There are many doubts about the authenticity of the scene. The staff of Tiani Arms Manufacturing Company can let everyone test whether the Assault Dagger MS is easy to operate. Representatives of purchasing groups from various countries arranged for people to conduct test operations on the Assault Dagger. The results of everyone's tests were better than those of the previous military otaku. Every tester said that the Strike Dagger MS is easy to operate, even children can operate it, and even commented that the Strike Dagger MS is better than the standard equipped MS adopted by their own country, so they used the response of the Strike Dagger MS in terms of enemy vigilance, it is much stronger than the national standard equipment. Now, many purchasing groups were blown away. The mobile phone that is easy to operate can also be used as a landline for those rookie mobile phone drivers who are trained. It may also reduce the training time of mobile phone drivers and can be put into combat readiness immediately. Moreover, it has a high ability to respond to and detect the enemy, which can not only improve the survival rate of the driver, but also improve the combat efficiency. All of a sudden, not only those weak and poor countries want to purchase Strike Dagger MS, but also those relatively rich and powerful countries want to purchase Strike Dagger MS in large quantities. President Sakiki never expected that so many orders for the assault dagger came all of a sudden. Originally, she thought that she could get an order of 300 units, and it was the sum of purchases from many countries, which was already an overperformance. What she didn't expect now was that the order was far beyond her imagination, and the order report in her hand had already left her at a loss as to what to do with it. Several countries that are almost as large as the population and economic scale of Mijia Angwa directly purchased 200 Strike Dagger MS. Mika Angwa, who recently won a battle and got a colony and a sum of money indemnity, not only bought enough 200 Assault Dagger MS, but also purchased 100 Special Gym MS. Some countries with a larger scale also directly purchased 300 assault daggers. Economically rich countries also directly purchase 500 assault dagger MS, 300 GM MS and 150 special GM MS. President Sake Chi looked at the continuous purchase orders of the strike dagger MS, and the total number of purchases at this time has reached 2,500 units. Thinking back to the several foundries I bought at the beginning, 
although they have been transformed into manufacturing factories for Assault Dagger MS, they can only produce 100 units in a month of full operation. President Sakiki opened his mouth wide at first, but then he came back to his senses and shook his head immediately. Immediately ordered the subordinates to immediately return all the orders purchased by the Strike Dagger MS, even if there is a deposit, they will be refunded in full, and then immediately announced that the price of the Strike Dagger MS is 35 million space colony coins, the common currency of the colony, colonial countries have their own currencies, and space international trade will be settled with space colonial currency. Soon, President Sakiki almost passed out. Returned the purchase of the Strike Dagger MS order, and soon came to the hands of President Sakiki. It was okay if you didn't look at it, but your feet softened when you saw it. Fortunately, there were two subordinates behind you, and they immediately supported him. She. President Sake Chi looked at the new purchase report, his hands were trembling. Not only did the Strike Dagger MS not reduce the purchase volume due to the increase in price, but it was more than before directly exceeding the total of 3,000 units. President Sakiki, she doesn't know whether to laugh or cry now, the company simply can't handle such a large number of purchase orders. President, this is the purchase list for armored combat uniforms, chariots, drones, and warships, etc. Please take a look. President Sakiki took it over to take a look, and almost fainted. I'm dizzy, give me a chair to sit on. The subordinate immediately took a chair and let President Sakiki sit down. President Sakiki rubbed his temples. The orders in his hands are really too big to accept. If he accepts all the orders in his hands now, according to the current scale of the company, he will not need to accept other orders for five years. On the other side, President Sake Chi was worried about how to take the order, while the other colleagues were wailing. I saw purchasing groups from various countries and other buyers scrambling around the units of Tiani Arms Manufacturing Company to place orders. The representatives of each company looked at their own units, or there were a few sporadic kittens looking at their models and introductions, or there were no customers at all. This contrast creates a strong contrast. Chapter 53 Foundry You Are Listening at Novel Full. Audio Many companies have adopted a price reduction strategy, hoping to use lower prices to attract customers to buy. Some companies have even approached the cost price to attract customers to buy, but the strategy is not ideal. Some company lobbyists even explain the performance of their own MS, such as powerful firepower or defense, etc., and can be equipped with a variety of weapons, which is not comparable to MS with monotonous equipment such as assault daggers. Although some purchaser representatives understand the meaning of these company lobbyists and agree with their suggestions, most of the purchaser representatives have a reason. Although what you said is good, we also understand that many MS need strong firepower to suppress or powerful the defense force to protect the safety of MS drivers, but the problem is that your operability is more complicated, which will affect the driver's combat, and the complexity of the operability will also affect the time required to train MS drivers. The simple operation is strong attacking dagger MS will shorten the time required for our cultivated MS driver. At this time, the companies already understood the reasons why the purchasers purchased a large number of strike dagger MS. However, there are also companies that are still unwilling to give up. The president of a company shouted at the company units surrounding the Tiani Arms Company. Dear representatives of the purchasers, although the operation of the assault dagger is simple, it depends on how simple they are. Can it be actual combat, how about our company use the latest MS and assault dagger MS to have a real simulated battle? After hearing this suggestion, the representatives of the purchaser felt that there was some reason why it would be better to let the strike dagger MS test whether it is really capable of actual combat. Tiani Arms Manufacturing Company is more than happy to conduct a simulation test of actual combat. The location of the arrangement is in the outer space of the local colony, and the MS of the companies on both sides are holding liquid bullet guns. The rules are simple, two wins in three sets, that is, one point for hitting the opponent. The result of the battle was soon announced, 
and the strike dagger MS side directly won two victories in a row. The president who proposed the test was still not reconciled, and found another reason, thinking that the drivers on both sides should switch bodies to test the actual combat. Tiani Arms Manufacturing Company accepts the other party's request. The result was still the same, the strike dagger MS directly won two consecutive victories. The proposed president had nothing to say at this point. However, there are other companies that also want to use their mobile phones to conduct actual combat tests and take the opportunity to defeat the assault short sword mobile phone so that they can win the order. In the next few consecutive actual combat tests, the strike dagger MS won. Most of those MS lost two games in a row. Fortunately, they lost two and won one. After other companies saw that the MS of the previous peers had failed miserably, they did not want to humiliate themselves, so they decided to abandon the MS order and win orders from other series. On the contrary, President Saki was happy and proud of the victory of the Assault Dagger MS in the actual combat simulation, but the order that came randomly made her faint again. With the victory of the Strike Dagger MS actual combat simulation, more buyers increased their purchases. At this time, the purchase amount of Strike Dagger MS reached 4,000 units. My god, if you add that gym is still an order for other series of weapons, even if you work hard every day, you won't have to accept other orders for five years. President Sakiki immediately called his vice president and told him to find a place to open a new factory and increase production lines. A subordinate came to report to President Sakiki. President, Snow Bin, the president of Festa Company, wants to meet the president. Sakeki was a little puzzled, Festa Company had never had any communication with them, why suddenly wanted to see her. Sakiki still asked his subordinates to invite the president of the company over. President Saki, hello. Nice to meet you, President Snowbin. The presidents of the two companies shook hands and said hello to each other and looked at each other. Sakiki remembered that the scale of Festa Company was more than ten times that of his Tiani Arms Manufacturing Company. I don't know that President Snowbin is here, so what advice do you have? Don't dare to advise, dare not advise, first of all, I am here to congratulate President Sakiki for winning a huge order. This is the blessing of President Tosinobin, and the company has to rely on Festa Company to take care of it. Saki said a few words politely. President Sakiki is being humble. Your success actually depends on yourselves. Apart from congratulating your company, I also don't want to beat around the bush. I want to negotiate a deal with President Sakiki. I don't know what business President Snowbin wants to discuss with me. As far as I know, the production scale of Tiani Arms Manufacturing Company is not large. Your company has received such a huge order. I guess your company will not be able to consume it for a while. Festa Company can help your company manufacture some orders. Sakiki frowned. If there is a company willing to do OEM, then the order can be digested faster. If President Snowbin is willing to manufacture, our company is very happy, but the price of the OEM, we have to discuss it carefully. No problem, it's business, it's for sure, why don't we book a restaurant, talk while eating, and discuss slowly. That's exactly what I mean. When Sakiki and Snowbin each brought some important subordinates to step out of the exhibition, the presidents of many companies in the same industry also brought people to block their way. Sakiki frowned, but out of politeness, she still asked with a smile. I don't know what you can do, fellow CEOs. We want to discuss with President Sakiki whether we can provide some OEMs. It is of course no problem to discuss OEM, but now. Sakiki's eyes drifted to Snowbin intentionally or unintentionally. The president of a company that was traveling with him asked Snowbin. President Snowbin, don't you want to go with us? Snowbin scolded the 18th generation of the other party's ancestors in his heart, but he still kept a smile on his face and said, of course I don't mind. There are so many people, it's very lively. During a meal, 
every president can happily communicate with others with a smile on his face, making people who don't know that although these people are colleagues, they actually have a very good friendship. In fact, every president in the same industry may wish to stab the person in front of him to death with a knife. Especially Sakiki, each of them wanted to tear this woman into pieces. This woman grabbed all the orders for every series of weapons, which made them unable to drink soup. If she can her order by stumbling, the presidents of every company here will be more than happy to make a move. It's just that they can't find a way yet, and now they are trying to find a way to get OEM orders. Sakeki also understands what these people in the same industry are thinking. She is jealous that her company has won such a huge order and wants to take a piece of the profit cake in her hands. If she could, she really didn't want to give them a piece of cake, but if she didn't give them a piece of cake, she wondered what tricks these guys would secretly play to drag her down. Even if Tiani Arms Manufacturing Company can really finish all the orders on hand, Sakeki also knows that they still have to share a piece of bread with them. Because these guys will never allow Saki and her company to have meat, and they can't even share a piece of bread. Sakiki could only divide the bread into pieces so that they could feed their hunger, lest these guys trip her up secretly. While everyone was talking and drinking, some uninvited people came to participate. The person who came was Long Hui Wan, the representative of Feichi Military Science Company. Everyone was amazed. This is the famous top three military technology company in the Hanxia Empire, and it is also one of the top five companies in the colonial circle. Sakiki couldn't help frowning, Long Hui Wan was his boss's aunt, which made her a little embarrassed. Long Hui Wan appeared on the scene wearing a dress designed with ancient Hanfu. Long Hui Wan asked with a charming smile. I wonder if I will disturb your dinner if I come here uninvited. All the presidents laughed and said no, and welcomed Long Huijuan's arrival. Long Huijuan pretended not to know Sakiki and came to the front, stretched out her hand and introduced herself. I'm here, Long Huijuan, it's a pleasure to meet you, President Sakiki. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm very glad that Ms. Long Huijuan can get to know me, a little person. How can President Sakiki be a small person? Your company has won purchase orders from many countries today. Compared with your company, the orders received by our company are not even a fraction. I have to learn from your president. It's too serious. After the two women had some courtesy, the dinner continued. Chapter 54 Nanomachines for medical use You are listening at NovelFull.audio In the few days after the dinner, the Tiani Arms Manufacturing Company negotiated with many of its counterparts, and all the companies that negotiated were able to obtain part of the OEM contract more or less. However, Saki only let these foundry companies be responsible for the production of hardware, such as the cockpit and software of MS, and his own company is responsible. On the other hand, after the Tiani Arms Manufacturing Company won a huge order, many relevant media reported on the event and many relevant media sent reporters to interview it. However, all of them were rejected by Tiani Arms Manufacturing Company. On the other hand, the Reaper and Thunder Gundams have already been put into actual combat. The task is to sneak into and destroy the pirate's lair. The Reaper and Thunder Gundams have completed the task perfectly. The target has no idea where the attack came from. Long Fei was very satisfied with the result. Both have their advantages and disadvantages. Thunder Gundam can achieve visual invisibility when Mirage is activated, but Phase Shift Armor cannot be activated, and it consumes a lot of power and has weak defense. Reaper Gundam can't achieve visual invisibility, but its absorbing paint allows him to avoid radar detection. The jamming device can affect thermal imaging, radar and other related instruments. The power consumed by the jamming device is not as much as that of a Mirage. The Zero Gundam is on the manufacturing schedule. After the Aegis, Storm and Heavy Gunner Gundam are manufactured, they can be manufactured together with the Gemini Brothers. Among the other unknown metals that Long Fei recently researched, a silver dot white metal Long Fei named, Silver Renium, and another gray metal Long Fei named, Bow Steel, 
the former of these two metals has silver components, the latter has a steel component. As long as these two metals are alloyed with other metals on the earth, and after mixing several technologies, nano. Layer armor can be produced. Long Fei decided to develop and manufacture Barbados and Astaroth, and the schedule was set in two months. Then, Long Fei went to study other things. A few days later, Long Fei walked out of his office tiredly, and happened to bump into Li Xiucheng. Old Fei, what new Gundam are you researching and developing recently? I haven't researched and developed a new Gundam recently. I'm researching something else. What are you studying? A medical cabin called Medical Nanomachines. Old Fei, do you even know medicine? Li Xiucheng asked with wide dead eyed eyes. Well, dabble in something. What is the use? It's hard for me to explain to you, come with me, I'll show you the blueprint, and you'll know. Li Xiucheng followed Long Fei into the office. Looking at the information introduced by the design drawing, Li Xiucheng's eyes became bigger and bigger. Fuck, I said Lao Fei, if you really succeed in developing this technology, then wouldn't our brothers have many people who can pull them back from the gate of hell? Nanomachines for medical use are not absolute. If the injury is too serious to be treated and amputation is required, the injured must still undergo amputation. Yes, there are no absolutes in everything. Having said that, if this technology is successfully developed, it can reduce the workload of the doctors in charge of treatment. You can say so. Old Fei, hurry up and develop it. Long Fei rolled his eyes to Li Xiuqing directly, you think I'm a god, if I say development, it will be successfully developed, and you can get things out with just a few fingers. Old Fei, don't say that, many of our brothers worship you like a god. Long Fei rolled his eyes again. Don't treat me as a god, I am also a human being, and I also need to rest, sleep and eat, and now I just want to rest for a while to let my mind relax, so that I can work better. Li Xiucheng followed Long Fei out of the office. For three days, Long Fei lay flat on the bed in the room. Long Fei emptied his mind, didn't think about anything, lay on the bed, let himself fall asleep from time to time. Except for getting up to eat, Long Fei spent all his time sleeping. Dot in the past few months, Long Fei has devoted most of his energy to work and research. He has suffered from severe lack of sleep for a long time, and the sleep time does not exceed six hours. This makes Long Fei's head ache from time to time while working. On the fourth day, Long Fei slept until he woke up naturally, and looked at the clock, it was already twelve, noon. Long Fei got up from the bed, stretched his waist, and twisted his neck. There was a click sound from his neck, and he washed and changed his clothes. Then go to eat, and then continue to work on nanomachines for medical use. It took nearly a month to successfully develop the first nanomachine medical cabin for medical use. Two days later, a fleet just returned to the mother base, and the pilot was severely damaged in a battle, causing an explosion in the cockpit, causing the pilot to be injured and unconscious. Long Fei let the unconscious driver enter the medical nano.machine medical cabin. Many people watched the seriously injured and unconscious driver in the medical nano.machine medical cabin, except that the head was covered with an oxygen mask. Soak the whole body in the gel. Many people looked at the wounds of the wounded, and the speed of recovery was visible to the naked eye. A few days after the wound healed, the wounded had regained consciousness. I couldn't believe it, I thought I was going to die, I didn't expect that I could walk back from the gate of hell, and what I didn't expect was that there were no wounds or scars on my body. Everyone knows that the nanomachine medical cabin for medical treatment was developed by the boss Long Fei alone, and the worship of Long Fei is getting higher and higher. The success of the nano.machine medical cabin for medical use made Long Fei decide to mass.produce the medical nano.machine medical cabin for medical use. Long Fei also decided to apply for patent rights for medical nanomachines. Gemini Brothers and Zero Gundam are in the process of being manufactured, and the completion of the Brothers has reached 50%, and the Zero Gundam has reached 90%.
it seems that Zero Gundam can be put into testing first. At present, the mother base can already develop three Gundams at the same time. If there is no problem with Zero Gundam, then Lady Justice will be developed at the same time as Barbados and Astaroth. In fact, apart from these Gundams, Long Fei also put the 100. Shiki in the MK2 on the plan, where to locate them, Long Fei had thought about the fact that the captain of the elite team would drive the 100. Shiki or the MK2, but it was only on the plan at the moment. It has not yet been decided when the plan will be implemented. Commander. In. Chiefly Jiming also thinks that these two Gundams are considered as mass. Produced machines, and they are also very suitable as the leader machine of the elite team. The only problem is the manufacturing cost, whether it is a hundred dot style or MK2, although the manufacturing cost is not as high as that developed in recent months. If it does not rely on its own mining company to be self.sufficient, the manufacturing cost of Hayakushi and MK2 will be more expensive than Yuanzu Gundam. Thanks to the self.sufficiency of its mining company, the cost of weapons and parts manufactured by the Tiani Mercenary Group has been reduced. Commander. In. Chiefly Jiming is considering whether to discuss with Long Fei about using one of the production lines as the production line for these two Gundams. Chapter 55 Taoxiang Sisters Wake Up You Are Listening at Novel Full. Audio. Boss, at the newly built Meteorite MS Manufacturing Factory, I want to use one of the production lines as the production line for Baishir and MK2. Okay, you can handle this matter at your own discretion. Yes, boss. Li Jiming discusses things with Long Fei. By the way, has the production line of these mobile suits for Commander. In Chief Jim 2 and the Dagger series been finished? It has been fixed, and some more have been produced, and the old mobile phones have been replaced. What do the pilots think of these MS? The General Army thinks it is better than Jim and Special Jim, and the Special Team is also very satisfied with the MS of the Dagger series. The 105 Dagger, Dual Dagger and Storm Dagger can allow them to perform their duties and cooperate with each other. What kind of MS is usually used by elite troops? Jim 2 and Dual Dagger and a small amount of 105 Dagger. The Dual Dagger will be used as the leader machine with additional armor. Can MK2 and 100. Style be used as MS for special forces? Yes, it can be used as a team of four Gundams or arranged as a leader machine. Okay, I understand, Commander. In Chief, go get busy. After Li Jiming paid a military salute to Long Fei, he left the office. Long Fei turned on the computer to check the latest news. War broke out in Sector 7 of the Colonial Circle. The war between two countries has expanded to four countries that have also participated in the war. The four countries will join the battle, either stabbed by a knife, or the allied countries will be attacked. According to the alliance relationship, troops must be sent to help. Many analysts believe that this war will not end in a short time, and may expand the scope of the war. Long Fei saw something strange in the news. Although it was a war between countries, the dead were also a struggle between systems. Long Fei also estimated that this war might be a proxy war. There may be funding from the Wanluo Federation behind the democratic country, and the monarchy country may also be secretly supported by the Garth Empire. With his right hand, Long Fei thought with a sinking chin. The Garth Empire will help these countries with royal power, mainly because they don't want these countries to be defeated. Once these countries with royal power are defeated, it will also affect the status of other countries with royal power and their safety, and it will also improve the morale of the democratic country on the winning side, and can use related excuses such as anti-royal power and dictatorship to attack other royal power countries. This will also affect the powerful Garth Empire. The Wanluo Federation with other democratic countries, we can arrange spies or organizations to incite local influential people to oppose the Garth Empire. Long Fei twisted his neck and continued to think. However, if you think about the arms dealers in the Wanluo Federation for a while, I guess they are already happily counting their banknotes. The coming of war is the spring of arms dealers, but I thinking back, 
I am also an arms dealer, so I really have no right to criticize others. Long Fei smiled wryly and shook his head. At this time, the sound of reporting came from the flat table. Long Fei connected immediately. Talk. The pair of Jupiter sisters brought back, the sister has awakened. What? Long Fei stood up directly from the chair, I'll come right away. Tao Xiang looked around and the female doctor who was examining her body suspiciously. Tao Xiang felt a little headache. She covered her face and her head was a little blank, her memory was fuzzy, and her head hurt and fainted. Where is this place? The female doctor replied. This is the parent base of Jenny Group. After Long Fei had other companies in the industry, they were collectively called Tianyi Group. Both Tianyi Mercenary Group and Tianyi Arms Manufacturing Company were part of Tianyi Group. Why am I here? We found you and your sister on a spaceship, and both of you are sleeping in a cryogenic stasis chamber. My.my.sister.spaceship.frozen hibernation chamber. Tao Xiang said to herself with a very puzzled expression, and then bursts of severe pain came from her head, and many memory fragments appeared in her mind. Tao Xiang covered her head with her painful hands, and cried out in more pain. It hurts. It hurts. The female doctor immediately comforted her. Spaceship, Jupiter Spaceship, Ida.Ida.M. Why name is Tao Xiang, here. From the Jupiter Federation. At that time, Tao Xiang's memory recovered bit by bit. Long Fei came to the infirmary at this time, Tao Xiang looked up at Long Fei, tilted her head and frowned at Long Fei, she didn't know the man in front of her, but she had an inexplicable feeling. Long Fei asked the female doctor to leave the medical room first, and wanted to ask Tao Xiang about something. Tao Xiang first asked, Who are you? Self.introduction, my name is Long Fei, the leader of Tianyi Group, where you are is my property. My name is. When Tao Xiang was about to introduce himself, Long Fei had already said. Tao Xiang, this is your name, and you have a younger sister named Li Xiang. Tao Xiang was surprised, how did the man in front of her know her identity? Long Fei explained. I learned your identity from the documents you left behind. By the way, let me tell you one thing. I once saw a fragment of your memory, what happened on the spaceship you were in. Long Fei said a few things. Tao Xiang looked at Long Fei in shock, her body moved back involuntarily, feeling very scared in her heart, how did the man in front of her know what happened back then? Don't be afraid, it's just that you and I are the same kind of people, both are new humans. When you were sleeping in the cryogenic hibernation chamber, when I happened to touch the cryogenic hibernation chamber, your mental brainwaves were in tune with mine, and I this is how I saw your memory. Tao Xiang was still a little scared in her heart, but what she was more confused about was what exactly was the new human being that Long Fei was talking about. What is the new human being? Are you and I still human? Of course it's still human. Simply put, it can be regarded as an evolutionary species among humans. The new human is. Long Fei explained simply. It's like there is a video. When your sister suddenly yelled, your expression was also very frightened, because you and your sister suddenly felt a sense of crisis. Tao Xiang recalled what happened back then, indeed she suddenly felt a sense of fear welling up in her heart. Then my sister is also a new human. She's also a newcomer. Then my sister, where is she now? Your sister is currently. Long Fei was about to say that he was still asleep when the doorbell rang. Long Fei pressed the connect button. Speak. Boss, that little sister is also awake. I see. Your sister has woken up, do you want to go and have a look? Yes. Tao Xiang was very nervous and worried. Long Fei asked the medical staff to prepare the wheelchair. Long Fei personally pushed the wheelchair and took Tao Xiang to his sister's infirmary. On the way, Tao Xiang wanted to ask Long Fei how many years they had been sleeping. It takes about 12 years for Jupiter to revolve around the sun. According to the information I have verified, 
when the Jupiter Federation was established, the cosmic year shared by the Earth Circle and the Colonial Circle was already 30 years of the first year of the universe, three years of the Federation of Jupiter, and the first year of the universe. It's been almost 65 years, and it's exactly that year, the Jupiter Federation has no contact with the Colonial Circle and the Earth Circle, and it's already the 115th year of the first year of the universe. Tao Xiang really didn't expect that she had been sleeping with her sister for so many years, her nose was sore, Tao Xiang covered her face with her hands, and tears fell. It's almost time to go to your sister's infirmary. Wipe away your tears. Don't let your sister see you in such a mess. Don't affect the elder sister in your sister's mind. Tao Xiang immediately wiped away her tears, and then entered Li Xiang's infirmary. Li Xiang was lying weakly on the hospital bed, and the infusion solution provided her with nutrition. Li Xiang's eyes were tightly closed. What's wrong with my sister? Tao Xiang asked the doctor nervously. Don't be nervous, she just woke up from a deep sleep, her body is still very weak, and she needs some care at the moment. Tao Xiang asked Long Fei. Can you let me share the same infirmary with my sister, I want to take care of her personally. Can. Then, Tao Xiang asked Long Fei to see the documents and materials left by the Jupiter spacecraft, and to know what memories she had forgotten. No problem. Chapter 56 Colonial Warfare in Sector 7 You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. It has been two weeks since Sister Tao Xiang woke up, and the two sisters' body functions have returned to normal, and they can move freely. Li Xiang is lying on an instrument, wearing a spiritual device developed by Long Fei on her head, which is like a crown. Li Xiang fell asleep like a little princess, but in fact she was more awake than anyone else. She felt that her body, and even her whole spirit, seemed to be integrated into the universe, and she could sense the movement of the universe. Long Fei sat in front of the computer equipment and looked at the data, while Yu Yang Chun and Tao Xiang stood by and watched. The data shows that Li Xiang's mental sensing ability, space sensing ability, etc., in terms of the level set by Long Fei, each item is at least above B. Okay. After Rika's test was over, Momoka personally took off the spiritual device crown for her younger sister. Long Fei discovered that Li Xiang's sense of crisis was A, and Tao Xiang's was B. It seems that the film at that time has proved that the younger sister's sense of crisis is higher than that of her elder sister. Long Fei told Yu Yang Chun to take Li Xiang away first. Next, what are your plans? Long Fei asked Tao Xiang. If possible, I'd like to take my sister back to the Jupiter Federation to see how my hometown has become. I really can't help you with this right now. Can Song Laigua send us there? It's my parents' home country. It's a pity that the Song Lai country has perished more than 20 years ago. The original space colony of this country has become a colony of the Garth Empire. Tao Xiang was speechless for a while, she didn't know what to do next, Song Lai country was not only his parents' hometown country, but also the country where she was born. Where are your parents? Are they still in the Jupiter Federation? Tao Xiang shook her head. My parents died in a work accident. Sorry to bring back bad memories, fine. Is your sister born in the Jupiter Federation? Well, her parents died shortly after she was born. Then do you have any relatives? There should be none. Well, you and your sister will stay here for a while, and I can arrange some work for you. Okay, thank you. Long Fei got up and left the mental test room. Wait a minute. Tao Xiang stopped Long Fei. What's wrong? I heard that modern people live longer than before. Can my sister and I accept such an operation to prolong our life? Actually, it's not an operation. You just need to inject the life. Extending medicine. Your request is very simple, and I can arrange it. Assault Dagger MS has gradually become the main service Mississippi in many poor and weak countries. In the aspect of destroying pirates and rebels, Strike Dagger MS has made great military exploits. 
many related media magazines, what is the charm of Chafong Strike Dagger MS? It can make so many countries rush to buy it, and it performed very well after it was put into actual combat. The military personnel of many relevant countries interviewed had a very high evaluation of the Strike Dagger MS, which is cheap, easy to maintain, and easy to operate, and many MS drivers can not only drive the Strike Dagger MS to deal with other MS. In addition to considerable advantages, it can also gain advantages against fighter planes. The interview also indirectly promoted the Strike Dagger MS. Many countries that were colonized in the 6th district, countries that had already purchased Assault Dagger mobile suits, increased their purchases, and countries that had not yet purchased Assault Dagger mobile suits also began to scramble to purchase them. The border areas of the 6th district colony, such as the 7th district and some countries or organizations in the 5th district, have also begun to pay attention to the short dot term MS of the assault and are investigating the development company of the Assault Dagger. What kind of technology can be developed so well? MS. The war in the colonies of District 7 is in full swing. More and more countries have joined the war. Originally, it was only the countries of democracy and monarchy that fought each other. Other systems also joined the war, such as the warlord system, family system, etc. war. The colonial war in District 7 is known as a war between the Democratic camp and other camps. Due to the war in the colony of the 7th district, countless people fled to the colonies in other districts, and a small part of them fled to the earth. When there are two countries in the colony of District 7 in conflict, one is a democracy and the other is a warlord. The name of the democratic country is Las, and the warlord's country is called Kurs. Originally, the suppression of the Belus country in the country of Kezer had already shown signs of failure. The leader of the country of Kezer had no choice but to use a large amount of gold reserves and valuables to buy it from a country that was also a warlord in the 6th district. A bunch of assault dagger MS. As a result, the assault dagger mobile suits adopted by the state of Kezer suppressed the flying wolf mobile suits and raptor fighters adopted by the Wanluo Federation state in the lost state. Moreover, in several major battles, the strike dagger MS won all the victories, turning defeat into victory for the country of Kezer, which was already on the verge of defeat. Not only to take back the lost colonies, but also to occupy several colonies in the country of Las. The country of Kezer turned defeat into victory, which surprised many countries in the 7th district. Since a country that was about to be defeated, it turned defeat into victory by relying on a mobile suit, this made many countries participating in the battle want to know what kind of mobile suit is so powerful. In order to be able to destroy the opponent, the country of Kezer even seized a lot of property from the colonies it occupied, and bought the assault dagger MS at a high price from other countries in the 6th district. As time progressed, the country of Los was destroyed. In the colony of District 7, from the beginning of the war to the present, no country has been destroyed. However, a warlord country purchased the MS of the colony of District 6, which in turn caused the Democratic country camp to lose a member. A blow to the morale of the Democratic camp. The war in the colonies of District 7 is still going on, and as time goes on, more countries will be drawn into the vortex of war. Long Fei is in a fleet today. The fleet has three destroyers and three frigates. The task of Long Fei's fleet is to find the pirate group. Finding the pirate group is not an entrustment from any client. If Long Fei wants to test the Zero Gundam, he wants to know whether the solar furnace installed in the Gundam is as good as the original one. Of course, there is also the Gemini Gundam that needs to be tested, and the pilots of the Gemini brothers are the two sisters Zhoya. The Yuanzu Gundam No. 4 and No. 5, which were originally driven by the two sisters, have been sealed up now. As more and more Gundams are developed and manufactured, the Yuanzu Gundam and Unit 4 and Unit 5 have been officially sealed up. The storage of Yuanzu Gundam No. 6 has also been put on the agenda. As long as a new Gundam is developed and manufactured, it will enter the storage warehouse. 
The reason why these Gundams entered the storage warehouse is mainly because Zhou and the others have improved their strength and skills day by day after fighting for a long time, and the Yuanzu Gundams can no longer keep up with their reactions. Originally, Li Jiaming wanted to devolve these Gundams, and arranged for the captain of the elite team to be the captain machine. But when Long Fei took out the blueprints of Baishir and MK2, Li Jiaming immediately gave up his idea, and Long Fei had long planned to seal up these Gundams. Earlier, Li Jiaming felt that the development and manufacture of Baishir was enough, because judging from the data of the two, there was not much difference in performance between the two, and Bai Shi had a powerful mega particle cannon. It was not until Long Fei took out the blueprint of the G Defender and merged the MK2 and G Defender to make a new design. Although the appearance has not changed, the performance has been improved. It is named MK2G, not only has a very high propulsion speed in addition, it can fly even in a place with a gravity environment like the Earth. Only then did Li Jiaming change his mind and decided to develop and manufacture Baishir and MK2G. Long Fei discussed matters with the captain in the bow command room. It has been a week since we set off, and the pirate group has not been found yet. If we continue walking, we will be at the junction of the 6th and 7th districts of the colony. Within these 48 hours, if the pirate group can no longer be found, they will return to the mother base. Captain, what do you think is that? Long Fei pointed to a fleet captured remotely on the screen. Chapter 57 Saintess of the Uya Cross Country You are listening at NovelFull.audio Boss, this is the fleet from the Uya Cross Country in the Earth Circle. You can tell by the flags they hang. The largest ship in the center of the fleet is probably the ship that is used by important figures from that country. Long Fei looked at the flag on the screen, the flag of the Uya Cross Country was a golden cross with a pair of white wings surrounding the golden cross. Long Fei remembered that the Uya Cross Country was in Europe, and almost 70% of the European area was within the Uya Cross Country's sphere of influence. Long Fei remembered that this country was considered one of the most powerful countries in the Earth Circle, and it was as famous as the Russian Soviet Republic, the Hanshia Empire, the United States, the Nanyang Alliance, the South American Allies, the Great African United Front, and the Saudi Middle East Camp. These countries will be called the powerful countries in the Earth Circle, except that some small countries form alliances with other small countries to form a powerful combat force based on the principle that less plus less equals more. The most important thing is that these countries or alliances above can become powerful forces before the Earth, mainly owning orbital elevators. Countries without orbital elevators either attach to these forces as vassal states and pay an annual usage fee to share the orbital elevators, or pay a considerable amount of taxes every month, and the countries and companies involved can still use the orbital elevators send the goods to the universe by hand, and make transactions with the countries in the colonial circle. The Uya Cross Country is a country governed by religion, and the leader is the Pope. The Uya Cross Country uses religion to govern the country and advocates peace. Since the establishment of the Uya Cross Country, it has not initiated a war on its own initiative and is a peaceful country. The Uya Crusaders have always maintained neutrality and have not allied with any country. Why did the Uya Cross Country come here? Long Fei said, propping his chin with his right hand. Recently, the colonial war in District 7 has been expanding more and more, and it is about to spread to other colonial areas. The Uya Cross Country probably sent people to preach peace. I hope that no country will join the war again, causing people to lose their lives. Don't let the people lose homeland. Said the captain sitting next to him. It is said that the colonies in the 7th district are basically all the countries that have become one, and the people of many countries have fled to other colonies in order to avoid the war. O.org, well, yes, boss, it's just that more and more colonial countries are announcing that they can no longer take in refugees. Later, many refugees went to the Earth Circle, and most of them went to the Uya Cross Country. I heard that the Uya Cross Country it has taken in more than 3 million refugees, and it is said that those refugees are from different countries. 
having taken in so many refugees from different countries, will these refugees fight because of different countries and because of the hatred of their families and countries? There are such things happening, and they happen one after another, which troubles the Uya cross country very much, and it is said that there are also many refugees who cause troubles and crimes in the local area. It is estimated that they came to promote peace this time mainly because they hope that the war will not happen. Continue to expand, otherwise, successive refugees will flood into the Uya cross country, and the refugees will seriously affect their economy and destroy public order. Uya cross country really loves to be a saint, and as a result, unnecessary problems occurred in its own country. If I were the leader of the country, I would not accept a single refugee. Whichever country caused refugees, I would let that country be responsible. The captain didn't speak, but the expression on his face agreed with what Long Fei said. The spaceship of the largest ship in the center of the Uya Crusader space fleet. Aina, the saint of the Uya cross country, is wearing a pure white saintess costume, and a white lace scarf wraps her beautiful golden hair, peerless and beautiful facial features, a pair of bright blue eyes, and a slender figure. At this time, the body sat weakly on the seat. With clenched fists in both hands, unwilling tears flowed in his eyes, and he looked out of the window with disappointment on his face. Standing behind him was a guard wearing a night uniform. He knew why the Saint Ana had such an expression. They came to the country of a pack, a country that promotes democracy, freedom and human rights. When the Saint came here, besides meeting with the leaders of the local country, she was also promoting peace. I hope that there will be no war, and I hope that the country of Apak will not join the war in the seventh colony. It's a pity that although the leadership of the Apak kingdom agrees with the saint's peaceful advocacy, the current war is to overthrow the tyranny of dictatorship for the sake of equality, democracy and peace for all. This war is a just war. The just battle these people talk about is actually just an excuse to beautify it. In the final analysis, it is just an action for their own political career, and it is also for the benefactors and capitalists behind them. War not only allows arms dealers to make a lot of money, but capitalists who hold a large amount of food can also take the opportunity to hoard food and then sell it at a high price, earning countless benefits. These are the industrial chains of endless benefits. In the final analysis, it is always the common people who suffer. No matter what the system is, the common people are leeks or domestic animals. The black dot haired male knight sighed behind the saint. Oh, your majesty, the war can no longer be stopped, and the common people who don't want to live a peaceful and stable life, those in power and capitalists don't care peace, as long as there are benefits, no matter how many people are sacrificed. Aina turned her head to look at the black dot haired male knight and asked, John, is it so difficult for countries to coexist peacefully? John didn't know how to answer for a while, he really didn't want to hit the saint with the truth. He understood that the Holy Maiden wanted peace, because the Holy Maiden was a victim of war before. She lost her parents when she was a child and was adopted by the Pope as an adopted daughter. The Holy Maiden has always wanted peace. Because the Holy Maiden understands the suffering of war better than anyone else, the Holy Maiden does not want any more wars and suffering people who have lost their loved ones. Aina saw the silent John, and she knew that John didn't want to hit her, so Aina could only look down at her white and tender hands, thinking. Why, why? Hey, John, how is Her Majesty's mood? A female voice came from John's earphone communication device. John was silent and did not answer. Hey, it seems that Her Majesty is in a bad mood if you don't answer. The girl's distressed voice came from the earphone. John didn't answer by default. Why are you so good at coaxing people? You go, you go. John retorted directly. Dot. Suddenly, the door of the saint's room was pushed open, and a soldier reported to Her Majesty and John in a panic. Your Majesty, Sir John, it's not good, our fleet has been attacked by a group of pirates. The number of them is huge, at least five times larger than ours. Aina got up immediately and went to the bow command room, followed by John. 
A red dot haired woman in a night uniform looked at the radar and frowned. She couldn't believe how such a huge pirate group appeared, and the target was them. Didn't they know that they were from the Uya Cross Country? Space Fleet. The door of the bow command room opened, and Aina and John entered the command room. Yuffie, tell me the current situation. Aina asked the red dot haired female knight. Your Highness, at first we issued a warning to inform our forces, but the pirate group ignored our forces and still rushed towards us. For this reason, I have issued all MS and fighter planes to attack the aggressive pirates. At this moment, John snorted coldly and said, Humph, I think the pirate group is actually those arms dealers paying for people to pretend to be the pirate group, and the purpose is Her Royal Highness. Aina and the others looked at John suspiciously. John explained. His Royal Highness has been preaching peace in various countries. Isn't this a move for the interests of those arms dealers? It's no wonder that arms dealers don't hate Her Royal Highness. These pirate groups sent maybe some criminal organizations. Or the mercenary group is pretending, and the target is Her Royal Highness, either kill it, or capture it alive. Aina closed her eyes in pain, her preaching of peace actually aroused the dissatisfaction of the arms dealer. Chapter 58 Zero up to test you are listening at novel full dot audio. Master Billy, we have already fought the spaceship fleet of the Uya cross country. A blue dot haired young man reported the current situation to the middle dot aged man on the screen in a respectful tone. The middle dot aged man said in a cold tone. Sock, you should know what to do. It is related to our interests. This woman is too in the way. The subordinate understands. Then the screen went black, and Sock began to march to mobilize troops. In order to deceive the public, a small number of the mobile suits and fighters sent are second-dot-line mobile suits and fighters from some big countries, or most of them are refitted from engineering. On the surface, it looks like a weapon used by pirates. In fact, these mobile phones and fighters have been modified to improve a lot of performance. The performance is close to the performance of mobile phones and fighters in service in the front line of some big countries. What's going on, why are the performance of these old MS so powerful? Here is suppressed, suppressed, ask for support. No, our defense here is about to collapse. The Saint MS and Pegasus fighters of the Uya cross country were completely suppressed. Every pilot really didn't understand that the MS and fighters of the pirate group were older than them, so why they could be suppressed. The saints and knights in the command room of the main ship looked at the current battle situation, and they were currently in a very unfavorable situation. Joseph, Bach, and Kuhn will fly the Pegasus two fighter jets, and Juan and Bella will fly the Saint MS. Yuffie gave the attack order to his subordinates. After the five subordinate knights saluted the knights, they immediately walked out of the command room to fight. On the other side, the fleet where Long Fei was in found the pirate group attacking the Uya Crusader space fleet. Long Fei piloted the Zero Gundam, Zhouya sisters piloted the Gemini Brothers machine, and some GM-2 MSs and Dagger series MSs followed. Play the goal is to deal with the pirate group and test Gundam and other MS. Oh, is this the new MS and fighter jets of the Uya cross country? I thought that the country's armaments had stopped for 30 years without any progress. It turns out that there are still new MS and fighter jets being developed. I underestimated you guys. Sock looking at the current situation on the big screen. However, only relying on a few new mobile suits and fighter jets will not be able to reverse your established defeat. On the battlefield, although the Uya Crusaders sent out new mobile suits and fighter jets, they shot down more than a dozen pirate regiment mobile suits and fighter jets, temporarily boosting morale. No, my energy here is almost exhausted, I have to go back to the ship. Joseph, Joseph, what's going on? Answer quickly. Bach immediately asked via communication. Damn it, Joseph, he was shot down, I, ah. Kuhn's scream came from the communication. Bach knew that the two companions had been shot down. 
Bach looked at the remaining bombs on the instrument table, and the energy was almost exhausted. Bach could only control his fighter and return to the space mothership. The Saint Seiya MS driven by Juan and Bella is not much better. Bella controls the Saint MS, holds a laser cannon, and a beam cannon swallows many MS and fighter planes of the pirate group at once, bursting out a lot of fireworks continuously in an instant. This beam cannon left little energy left for the Saint MS, there's not much energy left, Juan, Juan, cover me. There was no response from Juan in the communication. Bella looked at the radar instrument and said, Damn it, one has been shot down. The Saint Ana looked at the radar display and listened to the report, Joseph, Juan and others had died in battle, and the Saint shed tears. The dead Joseph and the others were childhood sweethearts of Ana who lived together when she was a child. Bach Knight has returned to the mother ship and is resupplying. Knight Bella is on his way back and is besieged by pirate mobile suits and fighter jets. Let the other MS and fighters cover Bella and break out of the encirclement. Yuffie immediately gave the order. She did this because she didn't want to see Aina being sad again. She also hoped that her childhood sweethearts who grew up together when she was a child would not let anyone die in battle. The Saint Seiya MS that Bella is controlling at this time has already had one leg broken by the blast, and the energy of the Saint Seiya MS is about to run out. She dare not make a slight counterattack, and fires a beam gun, which may directly cut off the power of the Saint Seiya MS. Bella was very anxious at this time. Although she was covered by her colleagues and rushed out of the siege, the number of pirates was too large. Bella's anxiety also caused her to make mistakes. A pirate MS was holding a light beam and stabbing at her with a sword. Bella didn't have time to dodge the lever, she could only watch the beam saber of the pirate MS heading straight towards her screen. Bella opened her eyes wide, she didn't close her eyes and wait for death, but she opened her eyes wide, remembering the pirate MS who killed her. Suddenly, a red light beam directly penetrated the cockpit of the pirate MS stabbing at her with a beam saber. In an instant, the pirate MS exploded directly, forming a cloud of fireworks. Then several red light beams directly penetrated the MS and fighter jets and turned into clusters of fireworks. Bella looked along the source of the light beam and saw an unknown mobile phone emitting cyan particles. What's going on, where did the MS come from, why didn't the radar warn? My radar is out. Mine too. Whether it is the Ouya Cross Country or the pirate group, they were shocked by the sudden MS. Could this be the Super MS Gundam boasted by the colony in District 6? Sok rubbed his chin and looked at the Zero Gundam on the screen. Then, mobile phones such as Gemini Brothers and Jim 2 appeared on the screen one after another. It seems that the three MSs with a pair of antennas are Gundams, and the others are ordinary MSs. The Gundam that emits cyan particles will affect the radar and sensors, but no matter what your goals are, you can't change the situation. Sok talked to himself, and then gave the order to prepare for the second quarter. Is this reinforcement? Aina asked everyone. Everyone shook their heads, and no one knew where the reinforcements came from. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Long Fei controls the Zero Gundam, and counts the number every time he shoots down a MS or fighter plane. Basically, it is a hundred shots and one shot down a target. Zhou Na drove the number one Gemini aircraft and her sister Zhou Yit drove the number two aircraft. The two sisters adopted the tactics of walking and covering fire. One minute into the battle, the two sisters shot down a total of 52 milliseconds and fighters, nearly one every second. Sister, the boss is really powerful. The performance of the Zero Gundam is not as good as that of the Gemini. The boss shot down nearly 30 MS and fighters in one minute alone. To be honest, the boss's driving skills are actually better than ours. The purpose of the boss's test of the Zero Gundam is just to test the practicality of the solar furnace. Sister, boss, will you develop a Gundam dedicated to the solar furnace next? Definitely will. 
the Zero Gundam dragged a long trail of cyan particles, shooting while flying. The test of the Zero Gundam is good, and then we can develop the Goddess of Justice and the Goddess of Judgment. Chapter 59 PX System Test You are listening at NovelFull.audio The unknown MIS troops have shot down more than 200 of our fighter planes and MS, and nearly half of them were shot down by three Gundams. Sok frowned, listening to the announcer's report. I didn't expect Gundam to be as powerful as the rumors boasted. When Sok looked at the screen, he suddenly jumped up from the seat. The picture on the screen showed that the Gemini brothers' machine had changed, and a layer of blue floodlight covered the machine body. What exactly is going on? Long Fei ordered Zhou to activate the PX system. After Sister Zhou turned on the PX system, her brain felt empty. The trajectories of all the airframes and fighters in front of the screen seemed to slow down, but her own reactions became faster. Make any response. The blue dot lighted Gemini brothers flew at an extremely fast speed, leaving afterimages and exploding fireballs on the trajectory they passed. During the battle, the two sisters could even predict the target's next move and take a pre-dedemptive attack. Shooting with a beam gun in one hand, and a beam saber in the other, the sword cut the body and fighter in half as it passed. In less than two minutes, the two sisters had harvested a large number of targets and had become the god of death on the battlefield. The pirate pilots wailed, no matter if it was a MS or a fighter plane, every pilot was unwilling to get close to the Gemini brothers, and wherever the Gemini brothers ran, the pirate pilots immediately withdrew from the area. Because no one wants to fight death. Sok looked at the battlefield situation on the screen. The situation that was originally stable was reversed by this group of unknown troops. Sok didn't want the plan to fail, and immediately ordered the second phase of the attack. Numerous airships ejected from the pirate fleet and many refitted ships, aiming at the space fleet of the Uya Crusaders, so that the suppressing troops of the airships can enter the spaceships to carry out suppression. Nearly three minutes after the PX system was turned on for the Gemini Brother machine, the system automatically shut down, and the Gemini Brother machine returned to its original state. At this moment, Sister Zhouya felt that her empty brain had returned to a normal state, and those tracks where MS and fighter planes could be seen could no longer be seen. The two sisters were a little out of breath and a little tired physically and mentally. At this time, the image of Long Fei appeared on the screen in the cockpit of the two sisters. Are you all right? We're fine, X2, PX system, what do you think? Zhou Yaxian replied. It's a very good system. The whole brain seems to be clear. You can even see the trajectories of all mobile suits and fighters. Even our reactions have become very fast and we can respond immediately. Zhou Na went on to say. Even our body's reaction becomes very fast, and the overall performance of the body suddenly improves, and we feel that we are integrated with the body, but after the system is turned off, we feel a little tired. The advantage of the PX system is that it can allow the driver and the body to exceed the limit within three minutes, and even allow the driver's thinking and reaction to exceed the limit, and even make predictable actions. It cannot be turned on. If the driver's status cannot return to normal, the PX system cannot be activated, but the important point is that if there is any problem with the body, the PX system cannot be activated. Both are indispensable. If one is missing, the PX system will unable to open, the three of them fought while communicating. At this moment, Long Fei discovered that countless airships were flying towards the space fleet of the Uya Cross Country. St. MS and Pegasus fighters are trying their best to attack these airships. These airships rush into the spaceship like death squads, and if they capture the command room or capture important people, they will be able to declare victory. Long Fei thought in his heart. Several airships flew in front of Zero Gundam. He. Long Fei sneered and pressed the button. Zero Gundam fired beam rays continuously, directly destroying those airships and turning them into bursts of fireworks. Boss, the captain of the Uya Crusader spaceship has asked us to shoot down all the airships of the pirate regiment. 
The captain of a MS team sent a message to Long Fei. Leave them alone and do our business. Yes. Several other airships flew past Zero Gundam, only to be blasted by Zero Gundam with beam rifles. Long Fei saw on the screen on the right that several pirate airships rushed into the hangar door where the main ship of the Uya Cross Country Space Fleet was blasted. Long Fei looked at the current battle situation again, the remaining MS and fighters of the pirate group would all be wiped out in a while. Long Fei looked at the battle suit he was wearing again, Spartan battle uniform, this was an improved battle suit from the armored war uniform. It is a combat uniform designed for special individual combat units and ace MS drivers. It can fight in harsh environments and vacuum environments. It is much more ideal than armored combat uniforms in resisting beam attacks. Long Phase Controller, Zero Gundam, came to the main ship of the Uya Cross Country Space Fleet whose hangar gate was blown up. He saw many corpses floating in the hangar from the camera. Long Fei took out the individual weapon box in the cockpit, opened the box, found a pulse submachine gun, a pistol, several clips, a flash bomb, a flying explosive bomb, a military dagger, and two doses of healing gel solution. Long Fei equipped these weapons behind him, opened the cockpit and entered the main ship. Escorted by other knights and guards, Saint Ana left the command room. Gun battles erupted at various points within the main ship. Every passage has a corpse lying on the ground. We can't let these pirates break through the line of defense. We must protect the safety of the saint. The sound of gunfire was endless, bullet holes were left in the passages, and there was also the sound of explosions. Why are these pirates so powerful? They are like special forces. A crew member with a gunshot wound on his arm leaned against the wound and said. It's too strong, just a few pirates shot and killed eight of us here. Grenade, shouted a crew member. Explosions sounded, and screams continued. When the smoke cleared, what was left at the scene were many stumped limbs and broken arms. He was the only crew member with a gunshot wound in his arm. He watched his companion die tragically, and the gun in his hand was out of bullets. He watched three pirates walk up to him, and one of them pointed a pistol at his head. Ah! There was a scream, and the injured crew member opened his eyes and saw one of the pirates lying on the ground, with blood flowing from his chest. The remaining pirates had already taken cover immediately. Then another pirate let out a muffled groan, blood spilled from his neck, fell to the ground, twitched a few times and died. The last pirate was holding a rifle and guarding the surroundings in horror. The injured crew member, looking at the pirates guarding all around, suddenly turned his head 180 degrees, and then collapsed directly on the ground. The injured crew member was very frightened at this time, he was worried that he would be the next one, because those pirates suddenly died for no apparent reason. After a period of time, he didn't have any abnormalities. Except for him, there were a group of corpses, limbs, arms, and injured crew members. They immediately prayed. God bless, the Lord must have appeared.